Hey guys, one of Bootstrap's greatest strengths is its community and you are going to notice that a lot of people have taken Bootstrap and extended it. So in this video, we will look at a very very simple website that I have created for you people using Bootstrap. I have a navigation bar here at the top. This part is known as Jumbotron which is used to showcase the key component, the key content of your website. I have a few buttons here and uh, some text arranged in columns here at the bottom. It's decent, looks very good. You will notice that we get this default theme with Bootstrap that looks a little bit like this. But sometimes you want to be able to go in and change the color scheme. So maybe you go with something like that's just very dark or maybe you are looking for something that's going to be more vibrant and alive. As much as Bootstrap is wonderful, you are going to notice that there are hundreds of classes inside of the Bootstrap CSS file and so trying to go in and really editing those classes to change the color schemes that is the look and feel of the website that can be a little bit of a challenge. So rather than going off and doing it all on our own let's go ahead and take advantage of the work that others have done and just go grab a theme and so what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up a new tab here and I am going to bootswatch.com so bootswatch is a great place that you can go to get free themes for bootstraps there's dozens of other places that you can go and get bootstrap themes for free or for uh, a little bit of free and so you will notice that as I scroll down we have got a whole series of different colors and options that we can take advantage of and so what I am going to do is I am going to use okay I am going to use this theme readable so you will notice that if I go in I hit the download we have got our bootstrap min.css bootstrap.css file so I'm going to grab the minified version of the bootstrap CSS file and download it. I will download it in the location of my project within the CSS file and I'm going to replace my previous CSS file with this new one. And just like that when I going when I'm going to refresh you will see the change you're going to notice that the font changed a little bit the color changed a little bit and it makes it just that easy for me to go in and change my color schemes inside of bootstrap and it's possibly one of my favorite little features it's just that ability to go grab somebody else's work throw that in here and now I've got a completely new color scheme that's the power of bootstrap I hope this video might have excited you guys a little bit more towards learning bootstrap. So stay tuned for the upcoming tutorials. Subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. Post your queries and comments below. And I'll see you in the next one.